Forza Inter, it's time for new team and tactics guide. Today we are going to check Inter Milan, very interesting club to manage. First, let's see training facilities. Inter Milan has fantastic stadium Giuseppe Meazza, capacity around 75,000. Training facilities are 18, youth facilities 17, uh, junior coaching 15, youth recruitment 18 and corporate facilities are 16. So, you still need to invest a bit, uh, in my opinion, uh, in youth facilities and youth recruitment. Get them to the maximum. Now let's see all the players and their current and potential abilities. So the best player at Inter Milan right now is Romelo Lukaku, current ability 167, he's 27 years old and check this, what a physical attribute, this is really wow, mental attributes also classy, technical attributes not bad at all, I really like this kind of forward, I mean he would be the number one target man in FM 2021, okay, uh, we see that next player is Stefan de Rie, Dutch ball playing defender with the current ability 163, then Samir Handanovic, Slovenian sweeper keeper, one of the best goalkeepers in the world for sure, current ability 162. Then Milan Skriniar, uh, many clubs want to sign him in real life, he's a very very good central defender. Uh, then we have Lautaro Martinez, Argentinian pressing forward. In real life I really expect much much better performance. Yeah, he's not playing that good, uh, I think that he's classy striker, but still need to play better. We have Arturo Vidal, a very player with a really big experience, check his mental attributes, this is really unbelievable. Okay, then we have Nicola Barella, Italian, uh, very young player, uh, future of Italian national team, great box-to-box -box midfielder. Then we have Christian Eriksen, real life. Uh, he's not playing at all, I mean they want to sell him, they want to get rid of him, but in FM he's still a very good player with a current ability 156. There is a Croatian box-to-box -box meter, that's Marcelo Brozovic, also very interesting player. Okay, here you can check all the current and potential abilities. Uh, but now let's see, do we have some young players with a high potential, let's see that. Uh, we have Alessandro Bastoni, Italian uh, ball playing defender, really nice potential, 169. Then Andrea Pinamonti, advanced forward, 21 years old, potential ability 155, really nice. Uh, Hakimi can improve his uh, potential ability 169, current ability 154, and he's 21, yeah, he's a very interesting player. Okay, then we have Bakayoko, uh, I think that he's a new player of Red Star Belgrade, uh, not, not that great potential, only 125. Hello, Taro Martinez still didn't reach his full potential, great potential ability 175, okay. The other players are not that young, but now let's check uh, under 20 squad. Do we have some interesting players there? And yes, we have 18 years old Sebastiano Esposito. He's a really nice advanced forward, potential ability 166. Then Luciana Gome, French Mezzala. On loan at Spezia, his potential 159, also very good. Then Lorenzo Pirola, Italian central defender, great potential 159 also. Uh, then uh, Belgian player winger Thibaut Persin, uh, really nice player, can cover almost whole right side, potential ability 157. Okay, uh, the other players are not that good. Uh, maybe, maybe I forgot to say that we have Samuel Molatieri, he's 19 years old and his potential is also very good, 155. Okay, now let's check uh, under 18 squad. And uh, there actually I don't see some interesting kids, uh, the best is Nikola Eliev, Bulgarian striker, but uh, not that great potential, 129. Now I'll show the best tactic information for Inter Milan. So this would be my first team and I would try to play something like uh, Conte, 3-4-1-2, an attack, two pressing forwards, Martinez, then Lukaku, behind them, I know that Eriksen is not playing in real life, but in FM he's still classy player, and the best for this position, so he's going to play as attacking midfielder, uh, then behind him Vidal, a player with a really incredible experience, still awesome player, uh, ball winning midfielder, and Barella's box to box midfielder, I mean for these two positions, so don't forget about Brozovic, and we have a couple of other really interesting players. On the left side, complete wing back Kolarov. He can cover this uh, position very well because crossing 17. The only problem is his speed. Uh, it's going down because he's 35 years old. 
okay uh, then Hakimi on the right side this position uh, is well covered fantastic speed great crossing he's born for this position uh, then Bastoni Skriniar and Devry as a central defenders of course on the goal Handanovic so uh, I played a couple of games uh, with this uh, tactic and as you see guys uh, after eight games I had three draws against Juventus Napoli and Atalanta I have five wins I had great win against Fiorentina 5-0 and 4-0 against Roma so with some tweaks this tactic can be really awesome now I will show you some players that you should try to sign Inter Milan has transfer budget around 23 million with budget 3.1 not bad and this is my short list of some players that you should try to sign first on that list is Pippi Japanese advanced playmaker what a wonder kid guys he's playing for Real Madrid and check this his potential ability is 175 this is really wow Real Madrid doesn't want to sell him but actually they will accept your offer around 35 million he's really worth of buying for this money okay next is uh, playing for Borussia Dortmund Namdi Collins 16 years old German central back you just need to pay compensation of uh, 825,000 this is a joke potential ability 166 okay next on my list is Yusuf Demir playing for Rapid Vienna Austrian shadow striker um, I mean also don't they don't want to sell him but they will accept your offer of around 31 million okay next on my list is Joshua Nyoman great for this tactic can play on both sides as a wing back incredible speed still very young awesome potential ability as you see guys his potential ability 169 and they will accept your offer around 27 million last on my list is Nikola Milinkovic Serbian ball playing defender he's very young awesome in the air not bad speed price between 26 and 36 so I think that you can afford him and at the end we can see that Inter has three team leaders that's Kandanovic, a Slovenian goalkeeper, Skriniar and Brozovic so for now you should not worry about team leaders also you have many players with a really big influence that's another great thing anyway guys this is my short team and tactics guide for Inter Milan very interesting club to manage in Italy if you enjoyed watching this video then hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe see you and bye bye